How you doing guys? Dragon Man here. Are you guys ready for a history lesson? If you guys didn't know it, this is George Washington. And you guys been carrying a picture of him in your wallet your whole life. There he is on the one dollar bill. George Washington. Very famous guy. One of the guys that helped build America. Okay, so anyway, let me tell you about the American Revolutionary War. Uh, the 13 colonies, see I had a sign made over there, the 13 colonists in 1775 all got together and wanted to declare their independence from the British. The British were taxing them to death. Okay, in 1776 they did uh, declare their independence and uh, they picked George Washington to be a general and create the first army in America, the Continental Army. He had a very, very hard time doing that with the 13 colonists, tens of thousands of men, because uh, they weren't used to uh, taking orders. They were bums, they were drunks, they were farmers. You know, they didn't really know anything about being a soldier. They'd go practice with George Washington for two or three days, and then they want to go home. He had a very hard time. So anyway, then he picked, uh, in 1777, he picked uh, Benjamin Franklin. He's on your $100 bill. And he was a diplomat. He put Benjamin Franklin on a sailboat and sent him to France to talk to the French government uh, to send troops back to help George Washington fight the British and create the first army in America. Benjamin Franklin really didn't have a hard time doing that uh, because the uh, French people back then hated the British. So he got tens of thousands of troops to come back and help George Washington create his own army. Okay, the French uh, army was using these flintlocks. This gun's 250 years old, called the flintlock. See that? And uh, this is the weapon that they used to fight the uh, British. In fact, look at all these weapons in the cabinet here. These guns, these flintlocks, are 250 to 300 years old. I've been getting these from other museums all around the United States. My collection is growing more and more every year. Okay, so let's go back to George Washington here. Four years later, in 1781, the British surrendered and uh, went back to Great Britain. Uh, in 1787, the Constitution of the United States was print printed and signed by our founding fathers. Okay, here's some of the founding fathers. Thomas Jefferson, he's on your two dollar bill, he was our third president. Benjamin Franklin, Alexander Hamilton, he's on your ten dollar bill. Over here, we have Andrew Jackson, he's on your twenty dollar bill. And John Adams, he was our second president, right after uh, George Washington. And uh, these are some of the founding fathers in America. In 1789, George Washington became our first president. He did two tours. That's eight years. He got out in 1797. He passed away two years later in 1799. He's the only president that never slept in the White House. The White House was finally finished in the year 1800. Okay, and we can't forget about Martha. Uh, this is uh, President George Washington's wife, Martha. Okay, guys, well, anyway, if you want to learn a lot more about military history going all the way back to George Washington right through Iraq and Afghanistan, you just come see me on a Wednesday, Friday, or Sunday at 10 o'clock. The museum will be open all through the summer until Veterans Day, November 11th, and then we close it for the winter because it gets too uh, cold in here. Uh, before we uh, end the video, let me show you some uh, more stuff I got here for the, uh, the Civil War. Look at my Civil War display. Unbelievable. Yeah, telescopes, get all kinds of stuff. Look at all the weapons we have now. Uh, we have the Enfields, we have the Springfield Armories, we have the, uh, we have the Spencer, uh, we have the, uh, the rifle just like George Custard used to fight the Indians. Uh, here, look at my collection here, look how it's growing. I'm always getting more and more and more stuff. Okay, guys, I'm going to say goodbye for now. You guys have a great day, and stay tuned for the next video. It won't be long. Thanks for watching.